and good morning. I just thought I'd like to make a very quick video about a couple of very very good features which uh, have been included. The first one for me is for the presets. With my big fat fingers all uh, I press these two buttons to go up and down the presets like other people do but sometimes I end up hitting the split here or the A and B or mostly my finger hits here and it goes off frequency which isn't isn't very good at all so uh, we have now this is now a multi-channel switch so I don't have to press this with my fat fingers my presets are this channel and then I go onto here this is what we use to talk on uh, local operators and this is the repeater frequency and you can put I think up to 99 others in so for me that's a fantastic feature because I don't use the microphone that came with the radio and that has two switches on the top I find this an extra important feature so that, that, that's number one I find that extremely useful another very useful feature is if you press the uh, the V and M switch here, which is the VFO memory, now we're on VFO A, uh, A uh, and number one, uh, you're calling CQ and the operator says yes, uh, let's go to 27450. Normally, going with a rotor, it takes a long time, but now we can uh, so easily get there with the multi switch. Let's say uh, you want to go to channel one of the CB frequencies. Ah, so very easily. So is it. And if you're a little bit off, you can always use this uh, just to get back on. Fantastic feature. Very, very useful. You could. Let's see, I think we can also uh, adjust. Uh, I have it on the largest, but you can also uh, have it on different settings. Again, feature number two very very useful and just one more very quick feature uh, let's just say we go into the uh, this menu and we want to uh, adjust the mic gain we can press the mic gain here and what lights up here is the mic gain control so we don't have to go back into the menus we can also uh, for example now it goes back to the kilohertz as it was Press it again, and let's uh, let the RF power keep our finger on it a second, and now we can adjust it from here. Makes life a lot easier, and to get it back to as it was, finger on the button, and it's back to kill hertz. Very, very useful uh, added feature. If you've ever been listening on 20 meters when there's a competition, and you wonder how can the operators call CQ all day continuously without getting your sore throat well mainly what they do is uh, they record the voices I can have eight presets here I'll give you an example I can just press this CQDX 19 Charlie Tango calling CQ 19 Charlie Tango calling CQ from the Netherlands on 27 540, that's 27540 for possible contact. And that's on my SD card, and I'll flick it down, uh, and I press this one. And this is 19 Charlie. This is all recorded. 022, calling CQ from the Netherlands, calling CQ, 19 Charlie. and standing by. And that's mainly what the operators do. Uh, they just press the pre-recorded uh, recordings, uh, sit back on a chair and just wait. And you can also set these that they come on every 5 seconds, every 10 seconds. Very clever. Anyway, I hope somebody found this useful. And uh, if you're thinking about doing the update, I do recommend it. There are many videos on YouTube now of people explaining it far better than I can how to set it on the SD card. Anyway. Thanks for watching, till the next time.